Welcome back. It will open with three days of football starting August 28th. The new football stadium for APS is state of the art. Our Lawrence Gilligan is taking us on a tour. If you build it, they will come. That's the outlook APS Athletics had when breaking ground on their new West Side facility. Next month, it'll be reality. We needed a West Side Stadium. We only have two stadiums. The last one was built in 1963, which was Wilson, and so we really had a need for a stadium. So far, there's 110 acres of prime sports real estate, and the vision is pretty simple. At the very end, they want to have baseball, softball fields, and tennis courts. This is a 110 acre site for us. Um, across the street's another 110 acre that we have where the new high school middle school is going to go. And so we thought, well, look, this could be a sports complex. From uptown, it's about 10 minutes. It's right off, it is right off the interstate. And so it's easy access to anybody in the whole city. A city filled with athletes ready to step foot on the $38 million site. Capacity for the football side will be approximately 7,500. The opposite side for track and field will hold around 2,000. We look at the cost too to see what would be cheaper and, and they were the same and so we thought it was, it was just, it would be kind of like UNM, it would be pretty cool. So we separated it off and it worked really well. Every APS school except La Cueva will be in action at the Westside Sports Stadium for prep football's opening weekend with seven games over a four-day stretch. In Albuquerque, Lawrence Gilligan, KRQE News 13 Sports.